Sit back now and you'll hear a tale, a tale of a faithful cane. It started when I woke up this morn and felt a lot of pain. I stood up my foot gave way, I started to swear a lot. And then I realized that somehow my foot it had been hurt. That's right folks, I am your girl Yensid Nerd. And today I am spending a lot of time today walking around dropping f-bombs left and right because I woke up this morning with my right foot in intense pain whenever there's any weight or pressure placed upon it and so I've been walking around my house today looking like a crotchety old man um, wearing pants that are probably too baggy for me and a hoodie practicing my old man ways for when I retire from all my hard efforts as a brand ambassador. That's right. So, um, I got a lot of stuff done today. I took a sizable chunk of what I earned for the Tulsa Fair and paid two months of my car payment. Exciting and grown up and mature of me. Woohoo. And by exciting, I mean boring. And by adult, I mean blech. And mature, I mean no fun. Um, so yeah, I paid bills today and swore a lot because I'm in pain. Um, and I am one of those people that refuses to take medicine until she can't get away with it because I'm like in a hospital. So that's the kind of person I am. Anti-med, anti-traditional medicines, which really, can we talk for a second? Traditional medicines... Um, when did traditional medicines become pumping random freakazoid chemicals into our body via plastic capsules? Who, who started this and said, um, let's, let's not use the herbs and stuff and the massage therapy and the, um, calling upon our gods and deities to heal us and just eating teas and being healthy. Um, but let's shove some funky man-made thing in our body, and how should we get it into us? That's right, we're going to create a tiny plastic tube thing, and hope that biodegrades all right in our stomachs. Plastic. Why am I ingesting plastic? Because I guarantee you, when I was a little baby, and I tried to eat things made out of plastic, my parents told me no, because they were worried it would, like, kill me or something. But as a full-grown adult, yes, tiny capsules made of some kind of plastic being put in my body. No, that's fine and normal and healthy and right, and you need to do that because you have a runny nose. I don't understand! I don't get it. It's one of those things about life I just do, do, do not, never, ever, never gonna get it, never gonna get it, mm, never gonna get it, never gonna get it, uh, uh, uh. no, I'm not, I don't, I don't understand how this became a thing, like, can I, isn't there a tea out there I can sip on that will take away the pain, or some plant leaves I can put on both sides of my foot where it hurts and wrap it with something, and all the happy, fun minerals and stuff will soak through my feet into my body and it'll feel better. Because I like that idea. I I really think I should get like a holistic medicine man, woman, shamanist something and ha and make that my my health thing. Because I really prefer the idea of like leaves and herbs and paste stuff made out of stuff from nature and mud than the idea of trying to swallow pills and disgusting tasting chemicals that'll only mask the symptoms slash give me other symptoms because of side effects. I just... Oh, that's my rant and I'm sticking to it. Um, yeah, so today paid bills, watched Frozen, well, not Frozen, Once Upon a Time, which honestly is pretty much just watching Frozen, which I don't mind. Um, and I'm waiting for all kinds of fun shipments and stuff for little businessy money-gaining ventures that I'm doing uh, here in town. I'm going to have 
um, some fun little booths in a local like flea market antique shop that doesn't actually require you to have antiques. Um, I'm going to have all kinds of fun Disney themed products in the booth in preparation for the holidays. So, yay! And uh, tomorrow or Wednesday, I will be purchasing a sewing machine so I can get my own Etsy shop up and running, uh, which I'm kind of excited about that to be an Etsy individual, an Itsawool, if you will. Itsawool? Itsawool. I'll work on how I want to turn that slang into a word that sounds pr pronounceable, pronounceable. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know if you found me enjoyable at all. If you did, subscribe. If you think I'm cute, subscribe. Again, if you hate me rambling, subscribe. Uh, in general, just subscribe. I will talk to you guys later. Be good to one another. I love you and out.